Hi everyone, hope you're all well. In today's video we're going to talk about website accessibility. So what is website accessibility? Website accessibility refers to the practice of designing and developing websites that can be used by everyone, including people with disabilities. It means creating websites that are designed with accessibility in mind so that people with disabilities can access and use the content and functionality of the website. This includes people with visual, auditory, phys auditory physical and cognitive disabilities. Website accessibility is important because people with disabilities should have the same opportunities to access information, products and services as people without disabilities. And by making websites accessible, we can remove barriers that prevent people with disabilities from accessing and using the internet and promote inclusivity and equality for all. Web accessibility is typically achieved through the use of standards and guidelines such as the Web Content Accessibility Guideline or WCAG, which provides best practices for web content accessible, um, for making web content accessible to people with disabilities. Um, and we'll go through some of these uh, best practices today. So one example of uh, website be accessibility best practice is providing text alternative. So ensuring that all images, videos, and audio content have text alternatives that can be read by screen readers. And this is essential for users who are blind or visually impaired. And you want to make sure that you're using Symantec uh, markup. So use HTML5 Symantec markup elements like um, the tag nav, tag header, tag main, tag footer to make it easier for users to navigate your website using assistive technologies. You also want to make sure that you use keyboard navigation. So making sure that all interactive elements on your website, such as menus, links, forms, um, can be accessed using a keyboard. This is important for users who can't use a mouse. And color contrast. So ensure that your, the color contrast between the text and the background is high enough for users with low vision or color blindness to read the t content. You also want to use clear and simple language. So use clear and simple language to make your content easy to understand all users, um, including those with cognitive disabilities as well. Um, and you want to use something called ARIA attributes. So using these attributes, it helps provide additional information about the functionality and purpose of your web components as well. Regular testing your website's accessibility with screen readers, keyboard only navigation and assistive technologies can help ensure that your site is actually accessible to all users. And by implementing these best practices, you can make sure your website is more accessible and inclusive for all users, regardless of their abilities or disabilities. So there are several tools available as well that can help you check the accessibility of your website. Um, so one example is the web accessibility evaluation tool. So you can add this as a web browser, as a extension, but it's a free web accessibility evaluation tool that allows you to test your website for accessibility issues. It highlights any accessibility errors or warnings and provides suggestions on how to fix them as well. Another popular uh, Chrome extension browser is the Axe Accessibility Browser extension. So the Axe Browser extension is a free tool that checks your website for accessibility issues while you browse. It provides detailed reports and ac accessibility issues and suggests how to fix them as well. Another ch uh, tool you can use is the Color Contrast Analyzer. So Color Contrast Analyzer is a free tool that checks the color contrast of text and background on your website. It ensures that the con color contrast meets accessibility guidelines and is easy to read for users with visual impairments. These are just a few examples of the many tools available to help you check the accessibility of your website, but using tools like these can help you identify and fix any issues in terms of accessibility and ensuring that your website is actually accessible to all users. So here are some examples of websites that have made significant efforts to comply with accessibility best practices. And the first one is Apple. So Apple is known for its commitment to accessibility and has made accessibility features a uh, priority in its products and its services. The Apple website includes the uh, keyboard navigation. So you can see I can use the keyboard to highlight different parts of the website, their nav bar as well. Um, they have high contrast, uh, color correction, and the voiceover as well, which is a screen reader for users with visual impairments. So this is a really good example of how um, Apple can, Apple have used as uh, the accessibility features as well. Next up, you have the BBC website. So the BBC has implemented accessibility features on its website to ensure that everyone can access its content, including users with disabilities. The website has features like text resizing, um, high contrast mode, keyboard navigations, and alternative text on all their images as well.
Next up, you have Microsoft. So Microsoft has a dedicated accessibility team that works to make its products and services accessible to everyone. Um, the Microsoft website includes accessibility, accessibility features like high contrast mode, keyboard navigation, and alternative text on all their images as well. The gov.uk website is the UK's government website and has made accessibility a priority. Um, and features like keyboard, keyboard navigation, high contrast mode, alternative text for images, and make sure the text itself is clear and easy to read as well, uh, makes this a really accessible website. And lastly, we have the Starbucks website. So Starbucks has implemented accessibility features on its website, including the keyboard navigation, alternative text for images, and high contrast mode as well. Um, and all of this kind of ensures that the website is compatible with screen readers and other assistive technologies as well. So these are just a few examples of websites that have made significant efforts to comply with accessibility practices. By implementing these features and following accessibility guidelines, these websites are ensuring that everyone, including users with disabilities, can access and use their content and services as well. So also with user experience, website accessibility features can have a positive impact on SEO as well. By improving the user experience and making it easier to search uh, engines to crawl and index your site. Um, so you'll have improved user experience. So by making your site more accessible um, to all users, this can lead to a higher engagement and spend more time on websites. And this uh, has a direct effect on your search engine rankings. This also increases your traffic, so when a website is accessible, it can attract a wider audience, including users with disability, who may not have been able to access your website before or be able to access uh, your competitors' websites. And this leads to increased traffic and a boost in your search engine rankings as well. It's also an, it helps improve your website structure um, because implementing accessibility features often optimizes the website structure and ensures proper use of headings and other elements as well, which can make it easier for search engines to crawl and index your site. The alternative text as well, so as you've seen in previous in the website's examples, providing alternative text for images can help search engines understand the content on your website, and this can help improve your search engine rankings as well. Um, and in some cases, it can result in faster website load times. So implementing accessibility features like keyboard navigation and semantic markup can make your website more deficient and improve its load times, which can improve your search engine rankings as well. In summary, website accessibility features can have a positive impact on SEO by improving the user experience, increasing traffic, and improving website structure, providing uh, alternative text for images, and improving the website load times. All of these features you can, can make your website more accessible and improve your search engine rankings and improve the overall user experience um, of your website.